Hey guys, welcome to another episode of the How To Guide. And in this video, I'll show you step-by-step -step guides on how to install Windows 10 on your home computer or laptop. So without further ado, let's just get straight into this. This is going to be a beginner's step-by-step -step guide on how to install Windows 10 on your home computer, desktop or laptop. So basically, we're going to use the bootable USB drive that we created from the previous video. You can check the link above and then you are going to insert this into a USB port and immediately power on your device. On powering on, press the function keys. Uh, that on my device it's either F2 or F12. This opens the boot menu and select the USB as the main boot option. After that, this will open the next window where we'll select between a 64-bit or a 32-bit operating system. After that, I'll press enter and wait for the process to load. Depending on your computer, this might take anywhere between a few seconds to a minute. And I'm just going to click on next so that I can continue and then install now. I don't want to repair my computer, so basically I just install and then wait. I don't have a product key because I'll explain to you how to activate Windows 10 in the next video. So basically, I just press and I don't have a product key. Then there are a variety of Windows 10 options that you can choose from, from home, pro, version, education, depending on the var version that you want to install. Just choose one and click on next. Now you have to accept the license terms where you can read it or just accept the license terms and click on next. Don't do an upgrade. Just click on custom install then choose the specific drive that you want to install your windows and click on next. This is going to format everything on that drive and it's going to be clean. Then on clicking next it's going to automatically start doing the installation process. This might take a while depending on how fast your PC or laptop is, anywhere between 2 minutes to 10 minutes. So you're just gonna be patient and wait for this to go through. As you wait, you can continue subscribing, like, or leave a comment in the video. Also, give a comment on what future videos you want me to cover on the How To Guide series. After completing the process, Windows will restart automatically and it will take a while to gather everything so that you can continue with the installation process. During this period, Windows might at times restart like thrice or twice. For me, I've installed a second operating system on this device, so I'll select the specific OS that we just installed now so that we can continue, we can finish the installation process. Everything here is easy and automatically goes through depend as long as you can understand the language that is used. So you select a region for me, I'll just look for Kenya because that's my region and then click on yes. yes because that's the only keyboard that I'm using no I don't want to add any second keyboard so I'll skip out make sure you have internet connection so that to ensure Windows is updated to the latest version and other key features that need to be downloaded over the internet well, this is basically for personal use, so if it is an organization, you can choose the organization option, especially if you're using Windows 10 Pro, it's a good option. So for me, I'll just select the personal use 
so this is just a, a demo well sign in or create an account i just want to use an offline account i don't want to go into that well it limits some experience but i think that's all so username i'll use rapid text yeah and then click on next i want to create a password at this point i'm just going to take you to, through the basic things that you need to accept so accept those settings if you have anything that you want to change maybe you don't want to switch windows to access your location all that just it off then continue as i said before this process is simply very easy fast and simple and eventually final thing is the setup will be ready in a few minutes this will also depend on your laptop performance so just give it a while before it's completely ready for use eventually we are done and that is how to install windows 10 well you might want to know how to activate windows 10 and that will be coming in the next episode of the how to guide series so guys if you like the video give it a thumbs up and also make sure to subscribe i guess i'll see you around thank you guys so much for watching if you have any videos that you'd like me to do or any other tutorials that you want me to do just leave a comment in the description below and i'll get straight into it i'll see you around